Kevtaku, congratulations on being first. Welcome in. How is everyone doing today? Hope we're doing well. Hope we're having fun. I've had a really lazy afternoon. Um, I also forgot to remove the hoodie, so we'll just do that real fast. You see, I learned to keep the hoodie facing the other direction, so my last name won't accidentally show. Came real close on doing that one once. <laughs> Glad to hear you're doing well, though, Kev. How 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 is the rest of life? Are we are we having fun? What are we up to? Because I, I was doing almost nothing this afternoon. I was literally just sitting here at my computer. I had like everything set up for stream ready to go. And then I still almost didn't go live at the right time. But that's OK. We're working. I I'm working, too. I I'm getting tired of work. Um, my one coworker who's kind of sick of his position, too. Um, <laughs> he was looking around online. Oh, there's a cat below me. Sorry, Scuba. But yeah, my my one coworker who's sick of his position was looking around online and there's a bunch of other jobs that um, he's qualified for. He's like, I'll send you the ones you're qualified for, too. And I'm like, absolutely. Absolutely, because a lot of the positions that um, he's finding, I'd be getting like a 15 ish thousand dollar raise if I get so. Only work four days a week doing night shift. I got I got the regular old nine to five Monday through Friday, except it's not actually a nine to five. It's like an eight to four. And even then, I'm technically supposed to do 730 to four. But instead, I do like an 815 to 330. Because once once we do the handoff to second shift, there's nothing for me to do at that point. So I tend to just kind of leave. <laughs> Every now and then, like today specifically, I did have to stick around because we were trying to get some troubleshooting and stuff done for the test cell. And it was it was a hassle and uh, not fun. And we ended up not fixing it. And we all just decided, fuck it. We're not doing anything tonight and then left. So there's a chance around 10 o'clock tonight. It's hard to work here in Sweden compared to the US. Yeah, we, we have a lot of jobs. If you're if you're looking, you're more than welcome to come find work here in the US. Sunblade, welcome in. How are you today? Are we having fun? Are we excited? Are we looking forward to the day? Are we are we going to be getting into a bunch of very embarrassing deaths? Leafy, ah, uh, yeah, I'm I'm tired too. Um I was up late last night playing around with stuff for stream. We got new commands in. You'll see the you'll see the names of the commands that I added for the charity stream. There should also be down below if you're on browser, a new uh, like extension for the donations. And I also set up um, charity overlays, which I'm not going to use those until the actual charity stream. But I can I can pull them up if you really want. Like I could go from this scene. To this one, notice it's zero, but that's OK, because we're not doing a charity stream yet. We don't need to do that. Z, welcome in as well. How are you today? Are we having a grand old day? Also, let's get shout outs for literally all three of you, because I know you all stream. We're going to start with Z, because you're first on the list. I don't know why it's in reverse alphabetical order. <laughs> not the step up, see? <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the giggles are adorable. I, I hang out in Z's um, stream all the time. I don't chat super often, especially if it's an art stream or if Z's on a, on, on a soapbox. Cause those those kind of keep just going and i'm not going to interrupt the soapbox arguments but kev you said pretty good here you work four days a week 36 hours and still get paid full time 25 days of mandatory paid vacation okay here's what i do i work 40 hours a week i 40 hours a week uh i get five paid days off and i only get i think 10 paid holidays throughout the entire year so 
Maybe don't get my position. Find a better position. <laughs> Come to you all in the US on vacation. Come to a TwitchCon. That's where all of us are going to be getting together. We're all going to be doing well. Just like how Z is doing good. Glad to hear. Now we'll do Kevin. Or Kev. Let's see what clip you get. Oh. Uh, I guess that's a uh, double edged sword then. Am I? And uh, you have clip. I I guess you have clips. I hit the button. A clip showed up. <laughs> I I don't know. I, I if you didn't have a clip, nothing would pull up. Like I can I can shout out stream elements, and nothing's gonna happen. But then I can also shout out the person I might have rated the most, if not uh, definitely a close second, which is Sunblade. And we get a clip. There we go. You work 40 hours a week, get paid 36 paid days off, which includes vacation, holiday, sick, etc. Uh, still, that's over a month. Could you not use my leg as a scratching post? Yeah, you literally have a claw in my skin right now. Thank you. No, no, no. That was not an invitation for more. Sorry, my leg just decided it was, you know, a cardboard box. But absolutely, you're welcome, everyone. All of you guys chatting right now, I happen to be streamers. And I know a handful of other people who might be potentially stopping by who might be looking for people who go live when I'm not live. Or when I skip days, because I am not known for consistency on streaming. But, you know, either way. We got plenty of other streamers in chat. We got plenty of people you can hang out with if I'm not live. The one exception is I want all of you here for my charity stream, which is going to be November 11th. If you haven't heard about it yet, I'm going to beat it until it's a dead horse and then some. So we're going to pull up. We're going to pull up the posters. We're going to go to the screen share. I already collapsed the folders. I was ready. Charity stream coming up. We're starting at noon Eastern time, November 11th. Those donation incentives are just a quick view of what we got going on, but we are absolutely going to be getting into it. We're going to be supporting Stack Up, which is a charity that supports veterans through gaming. And I have cat claws in my leg again. What is wrong with you? Why are you misbehaving? I'm going to have to use the spray bottle if you don't stop. But yes. So Stack Up, uh, like I was just saying, they are a charity that supports veterans mental health through gaming. These are my charity incentives and they stack. So if we raise a thousand dollars, I do it from a thousand, everything above it. We're going to be having fun. There's no official end time for when for the stream. I plan on sending out that link and really starting to push that link on Saturday. And then any donations made before the stream still count towards these incentives and then i have specific incentives for individual donations on stream as well we're going to be going for possibly 8 10 12 hours we're going to see how long i feel like going definitely come feel free to hang out stop by if you're unable to donate financially feel free to donate a lurk feel free to donate some chat messages everything you do and showing up being here donating money all of that is going to help in the long run. I don't have an official schedule for what exactly I'm doing on stream, but I highly, highly recommend you stop by just for the amount of chaos that we could potentially be forcing upon myself. Because I said, if we hit $1,000 on stream, I will shave my head then and there on stream. I have hair clippers in the bathroom right over there. 
I can grab them, buzz it right away. My 16 months of hard work growing out my hair right out the door. So, what, what, what is your determination in playing with everything under the desk today? You lose your under the desk privileges. Come here. Yeah. Yeah. Now you're in trouble. Yeah, the thing is, you work in Sweden, not comparable to U.S. jobs because we have high taxes, but we also have a lot of government mandated rights. Yeah, I, I know the U.S. job market's kind of kind of ass and not great, but, you know, it's where I live. I occasionally apply to jobs in Europe, though, because I'm trying to get to the F1, the F1 teams. Universal health care. Yeah. Luckily, I'm still just a baby. I can be on my parents' health insurance, so I don't have to worry about it right now. And my dad actually has some pretty good health insurance. So I am absolutely staying on his health insurance until I get kicked off when I turn 26. Not shitting on the U.S., it's just different. No, feel free to shit on the U.S. We know it's bad here. Especially like the, the whole workers' rights and time off and all that. We know it's horrible. Especially if you're working like minimum wage jobs and all that and you're trying to like get above minimum wage, it's horrible. Luckily, I don't make minimum wage. But I am still underpaid by like $10,000 compared to some of my coworkers purely because I only graduated college a year and a half ago. And no one feels the need to accept all of my internships and co-ops as genuine work experience. So it's kind of stupid. I graduated college having nearly three and a half years of experience working full time in the industry, like actual engineering jobs. And they're like, oh, well, that was just an internship. We can't count it as like real experience. So. Apparently, none of that mattered. Exactly. We're not delusional. We know it's bad. We just put up with it because the alternative option of going somewhere else with better, you know, rights and privileges isn't necessarily possible for a lot of us. Or if it is possible, you're still kind of rooted here. You know, welcome to the good old US of A. They, they like to really lock you down. And that's why that's why it can get real bad. But what isn't bad, hopefully it's not bad. I'll be honest. I never really know how people think of my streams. It seems like some people enjoy them because people will stop by and say hello. But I'd like to think what is not bad is getting to hang out with me while I'm live or when I get to hang out with a lot of you guys while you're not live, whether or not I'm active in chat or just kind of hanging around listening in while I work on other stuff. I like to think that part of, you know, life isn't bad. If we want another thing that's going to be bad, and it is bad, is the guns I have in Fallout New Vegas. I have horrible weapons, I have horrible armor, horrible health, and we like to fuck around and find out. I can't really shit on it because you can't believe everything you read online and without personal experiences. Oh, no, 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 make fun of us. We will make fun of ourselves more than you can make fun of us. Like, I, I, I don't think I know anyone who would like be genuinely offended. If you try making like a joke about how like America's bad. We might, you know, clap back at you if you live in, you know, certain countries like the United Kingdom. We're going to clap back and, you know, make our own jokes about you guys, but like we're not going to we're not going to get offended about it. Or if we are going to get offended, it's not in like a oh, well, now I don't like you kind of way. It's a oh, well, we're mad cuz you're telling the truth. It's fine. Don't feel bad. If anything, it's going to be funny. Most of what you read and see is probably right exactly. Yeah, there's there's very little there's very little that I see that's kind of you care kind of Alabama of Europe if red fish eaters. See, like I said, we'll just make fun of the UK. 
Or don't get me started on the French. I don't know exactly what it is, but I just know everyone seems to hate the French. And I can kind of get on board with that, you know? Like, if you don't have just someone to kind of, you know, insult, you're going to have to come up with someone. Just like how pretty much the entirety of the U.S. agrees, Ohio sucks. Which it does, but... I know so many people who have never been to Ohio and will still rag on Ohio. I grew up very near Ohio, so I had to drive through that state all the time. And I can tell you, there's jack shit worth seeing in Ohio other than Cedar Point. And most states and places you can live in the U.S. have better theme parks closer. So it's not really even worth going if you're from out of town. Yep, we're going in. Also, I thought about it. We are going to fuck around and find out with what happens uh, if I listen to the Kaiser and do what he asked. Just because I'm curious. I want to know. Worst case scenario, we reload the save. No hard feelings, right? Could we potentially be about to murder a bunch of people? Yes. Is that part of video games? You know it. So we're going to have to see what happens. And if we don't like it, we can always go back. But seeing how I played Fallout 4 and accidentally damned an entire nation, or not nation, island, to um, die to radiation and monsters, and I was just like, teehee, oops. I don't exactly expect myself to want to go back on this decision. It's just kind of a, I guess that's how it is. You know, you just got to hit them with like, it, it is what it is. I get my weapons, right? Are you ready to proceed into the underground vault? Yes. Done. Also, why do all these people have like Slaves aren't much of a challenge. super douchey glasses? Like they're not even stylish. Why ban shredded cheese? Well, I'm glad you asked, Baron. I'm gonna go ahead and insert the, the, the chip right now. Um, so, so store-bought shredded cheese has a starch coating so that it doesn't like stick together and become all gummy in the bag. And I think that makes it taste worse. And I'm a firm believer that freshly grated cheese is just better. Isn't that right, Scuba? No, nope. okay, no, she ran away. Sorry, no cat. The other one's out of reach. But welcome in, welcome to stream. Can I ask how you happen to find the stream? Ooh, I heard a click, I didn't like that. You have a point. No one can ever like figure out like what exactly it is about like store-bought shredded cheese until I bring that up and everyone's like, oh my God, you're right. Like, you're totally right. Cheese is just better that way. Oh, I'm getting radiation. We're going to quick pause so I can read Kev's message. So Kev said, funny thing, back when most people and Trump shit on Sweden due to due to no lockdown and only give recommendation to keep distance, nothing changed in Sweden. People just did what they usually do and can choose from. Yeah, it, I granted mo 90 percent of the U.S., depend obviously depending on where you were but where i was 90 percent of people were just like oh like i'm not gonna go eat um in restaurants i'm just gonna you know stay home instead and everyone seemed to just not really question it obviously there was a group of people that were like oh this is a huge problem and then there were other people who were like oh i don't care i'm just gonna blatantly ignore the rules but like the general kind of consensus was like we'll listen to the recommendation we're not really gonna you know push against it or you know actively campaign and tell people you have to do it and it i don't know it worked we did great also thank you for the follow manfred the red baron welcome in. i'm glad you're enjoying it here and where to get a block of mozzarella so mozzarella doesn't come in a block it actually co you comes in a blob kind of shape 
But uh, I actually know how to make mozzarella. I haven't done it in a while, but growing up, my, my family would just make our own mozzarella. So <laughs> a, lot of, a, lot we, a lot of what we do, we would just use the mozzarella we made. But yeah, no, Sunblade is right. You can, you can normally find a large blob of it in a grocery store. It's kind of like a, I don't want to call it like a jelly, but it's, it's more of like a slime, like, you know, like the containers of slime you would get. It, it's, it's kind of more like that, except it holds its shape a little better, unlike slime. But yes, you can absolutely get um, non-shredded mozzarella, and then it doesn't have any of that um, starch coating on it. You shred it yourself. Hello. Well, you're here ahead of schedule. I suppose I was not expecting him. Well, this is where I wanted you to end up after all. I knew I could rely on Caesar to give you back the platinum chip. If we choose for ourselves, we stay at home, use face masks, stay to one to two meters of distance and on buses, trains, we don't sit together unless we know the person. Yeah, a lot of like my university was one of the last ones to go into lockdown and was one of the first ones to go back to like in-person classes. And as we were getting closer and closer to having to go into the lockdown, it was like they started giving the recommendations of like, make sure you socially distance yourself and, you know, make sure you stay, you know, six feet apart, which would be, you know, two meters. And everyone just kind of like ignored it at first because this was like early days of the pandemic but once we went back to the hybrid system and like in-person classes it was like eh we're just you know this is my best friend we live together we're gonna sit it like right next to each other and then there'll be like two empty desks and then someone else will sit right there and it'll like we just kind of spaced ourselves out naturally so i don't know it worked no one died well, okay, a lot of people died, but no one from my university died. And I've never had fermented tea unless you count twisted teas. In which case, I've had those. <sighs> the so, chip unlocks this bunker. Hence, you have I would it. assume it's not good. Hence, Benny was captured or killed, possibly by what? you, but by my estimates, far more probably by Caesar's legion. Hence, Caesar gave you the chip. Hence, Caesar wants you to destroy whatever you find in this bunker. But there that's go. not going to happen. Hello. Because you're going to work for me. Dog ear computer, what makes you think I have to listen to you? I don't understand. Um, so what is it's this place? It's a facility I built many years before you were born. You might think of it as a kind of barracks. You'll understand soon enough. That's rather obvious, isn't it? The Sorry, I'm just opening something on my storage phone. Device. I need you to manually upload the data from the chip to the facility's primary computer. There's a terminal at the other end of this facility. There's a complication. While I can broadcast to this screen, I can't control any of the facility's systems. That means I can't deactivate its security bots, most of which appear to be active according to the status board I'm looking at. So he's also saying, despite the fact he's trying to control him like me and tell me exactly what I have to do, he has no ability to stop me should I choose to misbehave and Fuck around and find out. Ten Penny Tower. That's Fallout Three. Yeah, I, I was gonna ask what that is, and it, it, I, I would not know. So we're gonna have to go with that's a Fallout Three. My army will do what an army does best: defend territory from invaders and maintain order. The same equipment failure that prevents me from remotely operating this facility seems to have activated its security robots and turrets. There's a security room near the base of the stairs. Perhaps you can deactivate them yourself. 
I like to think you have enough sense to do the right thing. The rewards for doing so are immense, as are the punishments for not doing so. Why don't I have a gun equipped? Hang on. What gun do you use the most? I use whatever I have ammo for. And I've had a lot of 9mm that I've been just trying to get rid of. But at this point, I'm kind of running out of that. Uh, yeah. Like, 125 on the incinerator, handful of knives, machete. I got the ripper, the stylence 22s. I got a shotgun, but like, the varmint rifle and the 9 mil are really the only things that I have like a sustainable and like renewable ammo source for, so I tend to default to those. But like looking at the weapons I have, they're all bad. Like the incinerator is probably the best one. And even then it's not great. If I had more um, grenades for the grenade rifle, Varmint rifle is shit. I am fully aware. I can see that damage is nine. The problem is I haven't been able to find better guns. Which, granted, at this point, I have plenty of money and I can always go get more. I don't care. I am the law and order. His head's, his head's crippled. How's he moving faster? What part of having a crippled head sa says your head moves fast, you move faster? Get out of here with that. Get out of here. Put down your weapon and submit to authority. No. Go away. Like, sure, I have to unload, like, 30 bullets to kill anything. But... I'm also curious, if I were to tuck this away... So I assume these are the... Okay, nothing there. Locked hard, locked average. I can't even unlock an average. How useless am I? Well. Empty, 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 empty. Plasma rifle. Look at that. We got a better, we got a better gun. Grenade. No, give me all of them. What? Get out of here. What gun skills do you have? Pretty much nothing. Um, gun is currently at 38 minus. So I've, I've raised it a little bit. Obviously, it's not great. Why is it minus? Uh, I forget exactly what. I think one of the perks might have done it. Oh, trigger discipline. Fire slower, but are 20% more accurate. Because I needed the accuracy. Like, especially trying to use the, the fucking 9 mil. I was missing by, you know, 20 yards from five feet away. I, like, it literally was like, I try to shoot straight forward. Like, I tried to shoot straight forwards and I would hit like my bathroom door, which is over there. So I, I went for the, I went for the 20% more accuracy, knowing that it was gonna hurt how fast I could fire. Yeah, not that big of a deal to me. I also have the rapid reload, which, you know, helps. So that, it, my my mental was it's going to kind of offset like sure you fire slower but you can reload faster and you're more accurate so if i were to just kind of tuck this away 
What do we got in here? A tin can! It looks like literally nothing else. Well, can't do that. Guess we'll open this door. Guess we'll close this door real fast. Um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna need. You'll manage somehow. At worst case scenario, I just die a bunch, and that's content. You know. Uh, yeah, we're gonna use those. Yep, go. Very good, very good. Okay, that's that's what I want to see. Take the... I'm being shot at. Oh, it's a turret. I see. Okay, we're gonna... Just real casually step back here and regroup. Don't worry about the damage. Don't worry about the damage. It's fine. <sighs> Man. Hang on. Hang on. This is being this is being this is being mean. Good old It Cuz that's not it. Does it not recognize the turret as something I can aim at? Oh no, there it is. I feel this is time for the grenade. I I don't have enough like grenades for the grenade rifle. Not to mention it violates the Geneva Convention. You're not allowed to have exploding bullets technically. Get out of here. Okay. Got that door. Anything? Not really. Also, have I complained yet today about how slow you are in this game and there's no sprint option? Like, I get I'm wearing, like, heavier, um... armor, but... war crimes are only an issue if you loot. You know, there's there's a TikToker who kind of, you know, coined the phrase, it's not a war crime the first time. This rifle is also starting to run low on um, durability. Yep, that's that's what I'm saying. Dangerously low. I also feel like I'm missing. Is 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 the health going down? Oh, that time it did. That was that was good. That was good. I just got to do that again. I did not. There we go. Also, how come How come New Vegas the turrets don't drop anything? Oh, We're going, we're going back to the grenade real fast. Is take cover until the lawbreaker is dealt with. Yeet. Does that answer your question about throwable grenades? Warning. Goodbye. <laughs> War crimes is already broken by the U.S. by experience in bioweapon. You know, I, I guess that's fair if if that's the case. I, I guess. I guess you have a point. You know, it that seems like it might be semi useful. I'm also now out of regular grenades. So 
We're gonna get our, our weak ass a multi kill. I didn't even realize it was, but my boy, no, I'm not dealing plasma grenade. Eat. Noise. Turrets sometimes have ammo drops when perks are in. I don't want to have to get perks. I just want to pick up the things. Oh, hello. Goodbye. I think that one was a double kill as well. Energy cell. I already picked up a fission battery and I honestly don't know what they're for. It just had a cool name. So... Oh. I'm a loot goblin. I take everything. That's the thing. Carry weight kind of gets in the way. And it becomes it, it becomes a hassle. I gotta heal myself. Hang on. I'm about to I'm about to do something very silly and I'm gonna stop myself before that is the case. Pink. Pink. Fallout 4. No Fallout 4 trash collection. Yeah. Okay, I need Red X real fast. Pop that bad boy down. That didn't do much. A rat away. That will help. We'll do two of those bad boys. And we're gonna do some purified water as well. Oh, this door is gonna be a problem when I go through it. Um, we're just gonna... Bonus damage versus robots and power armor. We're going to do this real fast. Yep. Open. Yeet. Is that going to be a problem? That looks like it might become a problem. Also, safety first, everyone. Spirit run. <sighs> Software updates. Um, we're going to leave that alone real fast. Uh, purely because I'm curious what else is around here. OK, so we cannot go. We cannot go further that way. Mattress. There we go. I see where you are. I, I I, am where I am. Don't ask me where it is. I don't know. Uh, it looks like I can't go farther that way. So let's go see what's a different way. Like, what's this? Power regulator. Overload in a matter. Interesting. So if I explode this, do I ruin everything? And if I come over this way, I can I can not ruin everything. That's that's late main story like this. This door is late main story or where I currently am. I don't feel like I should have made it to late story. I 
I kind of I kind of want to fuck over the Kaiser. But also, those guys can run an absolute fucking train on me the second they see me anywhere walking around the New Vegas, like, landscape. So, like, do I really want to piss them off, or do I want to piss off a robot and no longer be allowed to gamble in New Vegas? I don't know about you guys, but I kind of like the gambling. Where you are and that door. I'm in late game? Yo, he seems angry. That's okay. Um, we gotta go. We gotta go. That's, that's not the right way. What? Ah. I don't like the noise it's making. Could I, in theory, still blow it up? Also, I didn't realize I was wandering the correct direction. I kind of assumed I was going to get lost down here. Like, it was surprisingly easy. I never even opened this door. Apparently, I couldn't, so it's hard to explain. I don't worry about it. I'll figure something out eventually. Or I'll just kind of wander around till eventually something happens. You know? We we gotta we gotta do a little bit of fucking around. And likely a whole lot of finding out. I mean, in theory, you did what the computer man wanted. I did. I I, I accepted what the computer man wanted, because the new slave girls are I don't like these guys. And they're stupid looking sunglasses. The computer guy just seems a bit, you know, bossy pushy. It, it said empty. I don't know why I clicked on that. So I committed to the You've bit. Carried out Kaisar's will, but I must confiscate your equipment again. Keep your the holdout weapons. We got to be careful. No, personally, I go with the NCR. I haven't done anything where I, I was able to interact with them past, like, little friendly, like, hello, I exist type stuff. So I, I don't really, like I said, I just kind of wander and whatever happens is is kind of the, the roller coaster ride I go on. I don't know. Stuff stuff happens eventually. I'll, I'll probably maybe make it to the end game and potentially beat the game i don't know that's the fallout experience exactly like i try not to worry too much about like the the little place markers and everything as well which i do want to quickly give myself a bit more help but like i i tend not to worry too much about like what the actual place marker is i'll just make sure i'm kind of heading that general direction and then not worry about it Like, I'm curious if I were to go talk to him now. Yeah, you bitch. I felt the ground shake a while ago. I'll take that as a sign you've got the job done. There are rewards for doing as I command. Today, your reward is vengeance. You get to decide how Benny dies. Go but I Benny. didn't do what he asked. What you've decided. My Praetorians will perform the execution. Unless you want to perform it yourself. Thank you. Consider it the first of many bestowments. All right, bestowments. Let's go. Level A. Kevtaku, help. What do I upgrade? I have 15 skill points. And honestly, everything needs a lot of help. My lack of ability to hack and pick locks is kind of unfortunate. The speech isn't bad, but it's also not great. I haven't touched repair, science, unarmed, or energy weapons. I don't really know what I should upgrade. 
What's what's the what's the smartest? Because originally I was joking that we're gonna do the sneaky sniper gameplay. So I just started boosting the hell out of guns and sneak. But then I realized I can't do jack shit with just those. So I started raising my speech as high as possible. And this is where we've currently ended up. If you are a jack of... My tip is, if you are a jack of all, master of none, I recommend getting repair 25 to boost guns as high as possible. We're gonna... We're gonna do that. I'm gonna trust you on this blindly. Mostly because I don't know what else I, I, I would be doing, so... Reduces accuracy. No. Bloody mess. Characters and creatures you kill will often explode. Extra 5% damage. Fortune finder. Considerably warm bottle cap. I don't really need bottle caps because I can always just go gamble. Like just just go play blackjack for like two hours, make a make like ten grand again. I made more than that. That's why I haven't really bothered. Gunslinger. Oh, that's only while using a pistol though. Your precision with a scatter gun is something to behold. When using shotguns, regardless of the ammunition used, you ign you ignore an additional ten points of the target's damage threshold. That's not bad. Commando. What's most recent? 50 pounds more Stonewall. 5% against melee and unarmed. Eh. More ammunition in containers. That actually wouldn't be too bad. Quick draw wouldn't be the worst. I'm thinking either Commando or Scrounger. The Strongback would be useful, but like it's not going to help me stay alive. It's just going to allow me to carry more stuff. So Scrounger will help in the long run. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. And then I can always get Commando later, so I guess we're going to do that. Excellent. So do I get to... We have nothing to discuss until you've dealt with Benny. Oh, I get to do it myself? So baby, what did you find down there? Drugs. I see. And how's that going to happen? Yeah, we're just nice. murdering this guy. Keep it simple, eh? Around here, it's one of the better options. Nah, I'd rather see it coming. Do it, baby. Make it clean. So if I pull a gun, is anyone going to freak out? Like if I just real, real casually, um, no, 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 no one's going to freak out. Any last words? Some of the slaves have been spreading stories about the burned man again. Oh, put that away! I thought you weren't going to be mad at me. You see what I'm talking about with guns are so freaking useless. Y'all seem chill. 
taking his clothes and his wife. Pick his gun. He doesn't. He didn't have a gun. Or, or is the gun Maria? Ah, it is. Apparently, his wife is a gun. I wanna. I wanna check the. I wanna check the drip. Hang on. We gotta real real fast. It's good. It's not the best. Um, I completely forgot at the beginning of last stream that I had this outfit on. And then it went to do the little, you know, cutscene, kill scene, whatever, and scared the scared the crap out of me. I was not expecting it. All right, I murdered the man. I'm sure you found Benny's demise pleasing. No, it was actually rather frustrating. I had to like ping, 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 ping. Let's press on, shall we? As I was telling you before, I want Mr. House out of the picture. You have an interest yeah. in his death too. If he knows that you I don't know if I do. gadgets beneath the fort, he will strike back. You know where to find him. How he dies, I leave up to you. Okay. Complete your mission and return to me. Did you do the Poseidon energy quit? Probably not, because I have no clue what you're talking about. The new slave girls are quite... Why do they all talk about the new slave girls as if I myself am also not a woman? Like, I know I got the spiky metal armor on, but like, y'all just saw the outfit. Like... You're really going to talk to me about the new slave girls? Seem, seems a bit insensitive, don't you think? I'm looking forward to getting sent across the river. Shut up about the river. All right, I can't use this. It's an energy plant just north of Dino Town. I have not done that. I've kind of just been, you know, wandering around wherever um, the quest says to go and not worried about it. Also, why y'all got crucifix crucifixion stuff way out over here where there's no pathway leading to it? What is your end game? I don't understand what your goal was putting them way out there. It just seems like more of a hassle. All right. If I drop here. Oh. I was going to say, if I drop here, I shouldn't take any damage. But I did. So now we got to have that. I haven't tried going through this gate before. I can't. Okay. That that explains why I haven't gone through the gate before. It's a fun thing. I, I can try heading that direction. I, we'll see what happens. Can I go? Are you ready to return to Cottonwood Cove? I don't see why we have to go all the way to Cottonwood Cove, but you know. Sure. Nice. Like. I'm not exactly a genius, but getting dropped off here seems a bit ridiculous. When we were just up here. We were what, like literally like right here? Was it, was it not like right here? I'm pretty sure it was right here. Like, why not just meet in Boulder City? Seems like a huge waste of time. I also never poked my head in here. Oh, that's because I can't. Understandable. This is some very clear water. It's radiation free water. How exciting. I'm going to run out of air. 
I just wanted to go over this boat. I was curious how much radiation I was going to get. Apparently this water is fine. Whee. Is this a boat or a submarine, actually? It's kind of... No, it's a boat. It is a boat. It kind of started to look like a submarine for a second. You mean to tell me there's nothing at this boat? I also don't like that the space bar doesn't, like, lift you up in the water. You have to look up. I got so used to Subnautica. Yeah, there's literally nothing over here. What a waste of my time. There's a shopping cart, though. That's very bottom of a river. Oh, dear Lord, I've gotten rid of so much of my health by nearly drowning. Why was no one about to warn me? No one warned me of the dangers of drowning. I did not mean to click that. I don't know what I just took. So for future reference, if you notice, I'm about to, you know, kill myself because I'm playing around with a shopping cart. Feel free to let me know ahead of time. Sound fair? Is that is that something we can all agree on? Oh, it was sugar bombs I took. Okay, that's fine. Yep, I don't know what that says. What's this door do? I never really explored this area. Slave scarf? Why would I want to steal a slave scarf? Why would I want to steal... I was about to say, why, do, why would I want to steal an empty Sunset Sarsaparilla? And then I found... Bubblegum, no. I want... Should I be concerned about the amount of karma I'm losing? Like, is this, is this something I should be concerned about? Or are we okay? It's fine. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. Like, if I simply don't believe in karma, what's it going to do to me? Hunting rifle? That's normally pretty good. That's where everything turned around last time. I got the hunting rifle in um, Fallout 4, and, and life became better. Oh, this has almost no health right now, though. Okay, we're going to have to get that repaired. But... But we got it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Those seem like they might be useful. Interesting. Okay. Oh, I'm back outside. He seems chill. 
if you do good things in the wasteland and quests, you still, you will still be good no matter how much you steal. It was like more sexy sleepwear. My thing was, if I'm not seen, is it really going to change anything? A 10 mil pistol. Sure. 22 LR rounds. Interesting, interesting. My thing is, I just don't want to steal if it's like very obvious someone is going to be able to see me. Don't know what that is, but I took it. Give me all your beers. Get on the beers. Karma is just like Adam, an unseen and all-knowing entity in the universe. You know, it... I just know, you know, the sky, the Skyrim technique of crouch down, as long as it says hitting, you're golden. What's in the desk? Boom. And Lad's life. And patrol notes. And whatever that is. It's all mine now. Anything I'm missing? Nope, doesn't look like it. Da 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 da. What's in the storage? Open metal box. Yes. Empty. 20 gauge. 20 gauge. Empty, 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 empty. Apple. What was that? Police baton. Don't need it. Toolbox. Don't need it. A phony metal box. Open crate. Open crate. We're just loading up on the sunsets. Activate reloading bench. Made at skill requirement. Yeah, I don't have I don't have any of this. Which is fair. I don't exactly have lead. Um, so reloading stations are kind of useless to me right now. We're not going to worry about that. We're not going to worry about it. It is all OK. What else can I steal? If you got to decide on a side quest, probably go beside an energy. Like I said, I can head that direction. I'm just in the middle of realizing this bathroom is trashed. So I was just trying to see what was in here. Um, turns out nothing really. All right. Oh, I went in the wrong bathroom. How silly of me. What's in here? I'm allowed to be in this one. I find it funny that I go into the into the women's bathroom and suddenly I'm not stealing because. Uh, apparently it was just bad that I went to the wrong bathroom. Which I mean, like, fair enough. Okay, I know my shoulders kind of be kind of be a bit chunky with this. Oh, whoa. With this um armor, but like Really? Really? The game's calling me fat. I can fit in this one no problem. Not this one. Only this one. What about this one? Nope. Okay. Well. You know, I did my best. I did my best. It wasn't good enough. I can I can apparently only use one toilet, but you know. Uh, 
I don't know how they did not see me. I apparently can't pick that stuff up. What's all this? What's all this? So why am I not allowed in here? What is in here that I'm not supposed to get to that it said do not open this door or you're going to be in trouble? I don't get it. There's literally nothing in here. So why was it red? Was it because someone else owned it? In which case, it sucks for them. All right. I think I'm running out of out of um, buildings to to loot down here. Because, yeah, these are all these are all boarded up. OK. All right. So now. We're going to wander back off. I also came down the mountain from like over here just randomly did not take the pathway. Suppose we could go back that, you know, along the pathway, because uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to walk up this. Just a bit of a hunch. I also want to see what that is. So we're going to have to find a way up there. And this is a Bethesda game. Which means if you are determined, you can walk up any cliff face. And cut back. Ah, uh, there we go. Fortunately, not a lot of queuing in the apocalypse bathroom. I guess, I guess you have a point. Why is this truck giving off radiation? What is it about the truck that says radiation? Oh, cause there, there is literally radioactive barrels in the back of the truck. Especially if you got a horse. Does this game have horses? Is that a thing? Am I just very uncultured to not realize that there is a horse in this game? A butter knife. No, thank you. I've yet to see anyone else on a horse. I just. I don't know. I, I, I just haven't worried about it. Which, to be fair, Fallout 4 did not have horses, so I just. Never occurred to me that you might be able to get a horse. What does this say? Scenic Overlook. Let's go see how scenic this is. Well, there's nothing in there, that's for sure. Could use more trees. And less tires embedded in Boulders. You know, it's not great. It's not awful. Um, maybe it's just because I'm spoiled and from the Midwest where we have a lot of trees. So. I don't know. This just isn't what, you know, nature looks like around where I am. No horses, they had low radioactive metabolism. OK, so it's not like I'm completely missing the, the opportunity to have a horse. That is fair. But if they were in the game, they would be able to climb any surface like in Skyrim. Yep. Do you need two different finance clipboards? Because I know where to find them. Yeah, no, I I, I abuse the, the shit out of that mechanic in Skyrim. Once I once I had a horse, there was no going back from that lifestyle. And then it was a game of how to of um, what's the coolest horse I can get. 
So I would do the Dark Brotherhood questline specifically for the horse, and the second I got the horse, I would just stop. Or I would do the Thieves Guild to get the Skeleton Key, and then just stop. Because the Skeleton Key is an unbreakable lockpick. Obviously, I'm not going to go give it to the Thief who's running the guild. I'm going to go get the Skeleton Key and then just not give it to anyone. And then have it for myself. Also, can we talk about the angle that this road is on? There is no way your regular, you know, everyday car would be able to make it up this road. Like, this is what, like a 45 degree angle? Like, I, I know my head gets held pretty, pretty, you know, level. Um, yeah, that's pretty close to like 45. So not many cars would be able to make that make this slope. Like it's steeper right here, too. Like right here looks like the steepest, in which case it's maybe like a 50 degree angle. Ignore the part where I just moved backwards. I, I put my hand on the wrong spot on my keyboard. Don't worry about it. They got some fission reactor cars, so they probably could. Oh, no, fuck off. Fuck off. I forget what I have equipped as well. I also forgot that window scrolls while I scroll in game. So now I'm looking at channel point redeems from like two months ago. We're gonna pink. Now I gotta scroll up just to make sure I don't miss anything. My brother in Christ. Get the fuck out of here. 308 rounds. Nice. Also, I need to drop my radiation again. It's starting to get a bit out of hand. Pink. So now if I stand near him just to get the... Nope, okay, doesn't matter. Okay, so we are going to stay the fuck away from there. Which is why we initially went down the mountainside in the first place. But yeah, like I was saying, just like your common everyday car, at least in today's day and... Thank you for loading in the water, that looked really weird. At least in today's day and age, cars cannot naturally make it up this kind of slope unless they're like built for off roading. Especially like this kind of, you know, ground would would not be nice and friendly. For for trying to get up a slope, maybe if you had like a smooth paved road, it would be a little easier. But especially on like this kind of this kind of terrain, it's not happening. Also, this is why I stole all the Sunset Sarsaparillas. Because I got to pop three of them. Because of one enemy. Also, I can think. All right. Ugh. So I got to get back to the dinosaur town. That's dinosaur town. So just north. So I'd, I'd assume up here. Or maybe here. 
I don't know. We're heading the right direction, though. Oh, there's the place I went through before. Yeah, I, I hooked that way to stay clear of the, the Radiation City. Because I got absolutely run the fuck over the first time I tried going through it. Because the ghouls are like twice my speed. And I don't I don't rock with that. Also, hang on, hang on, hang on. Quick idea on how to move faster. All right. We're moving faster now. We're not wearing clothes, but we're moving faster, so it counts. All right. Uh, there we go. Don't mind me. So this road should take me back to Novak. And then... No fast travel play. I try not to, because it kind of I feel like it kind of takes away from the whole thing. So. Of what I I try not to do the fast travel, especially like when I'm doing it for stream. If I'm just playing like on my own, then no, I would absolutely fast travel. But in an attempt to, you know, have more fun and stream and end up in situations where I fuck around and find out more often. I need to put on my armor. How is that 14, 24? How? How? Yeah, that, that shit did nothing. I gotta wait till he's like right here. 95. Notice he's not dead. Where's the other one now? He looks, he looks a little stuck. There he is. Why is it in a cage? Because he growled at me. Get on it, mate. Oh, there's still two more people, things. I don't. Okay. Well. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on that. Now we got some radiation as well. Yeah, no, this seems like an area I probably should not be. Hey. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. My brother. Get out of here. Can't be having that. When playing Fallout 3, you might want to mod an Iron Sight. I, I haven't modded any of these guns yet. I haven't repaired any guns either. I just kind of let them break and... Uh, New Vegas? There it is. It took a second. We got it. We got it figured out. Why? Nope. Nope. How do they know to run away? 
They're lizards. What do you mean it knows to run away? Yeet. Get out of here. There we go. Whew. All right. What do you do when they break? I just select another weapon and move on. It's it's not exactly the best habit of mine. Look, a dead guy. Did I leave anything on him? No. Another dead guy. Also, shouldn't dead guys despawn? Heathen. I haven't been able to repair. I never bothered upgrading the repair thing, and I was like, oh, I'll just get back to these eventually. There was the one guy at, like, um, the, the Legion that could repair stuff, so I had him repair my armor. And that cost me, like, three grand. And I was like, screw that, I'm not doing this with weapons, too. Or I'm gonna have to go become, like, a real gambling addict to be able to afford that kind of stuff. I gotta tell you how to repair- I- I figured I would figure it out eventually once I bothered upgrading the repair or whatever. I feel like I walked around over here before. Yeah, it's just like little rockets. I remember this now. I don't remember checking in here, though. Shouldn't have bothered. All right. Think. All right, we set the save. When you kill people, they got stupid weapons on, weapons on them. Use those scrap weapons as repair materials. My thing is just trying to stay under carry weight. I, I pretty much chill at the carry weight. I don't have a lot of freedom to just start picking up other random stuff. So you said go north power plant. So like, is it that thing? Is it that thing? I don't know. We're just going to head that direction. Especially because my objective is that direction. So it kind of works itself out. Empty dumpsters. Unbelievable. Some types of weapons repair other weapons and armor. Like I said, I, I, I figured I'd eventually figure that out. I'd click on something and realize something, and I just kind of ran with it. Hasn't failed me yet. This seems... This seems like it was done after the cars ended up like this. Oh, they got actual names. How chill. All right, let's see what's in here. Hello? Are you the owner of this house? That doesn't answer my question. All right, let's see. Yo, there's a person. Activate workbench. See, look at all this stuff I don't have. Recycling flamer fuel. OK. 
conversion MF to SEC. What the fuck is either of these? So I assume MFC is microfusion cell, but what's SEC? When it says recycling flamer fuel, is that recycling... I don't like that noise, but it's also kind of fun to just... <laughs> like, you, you guys are hearing that too, right? That's not like my headphones, like, freaking out. I don't know what I'm doing. I guess I made flame flamer fuel. Yeah, I don't know what SEC is. Oh, it's faster on this one. We're gonna we're gonna do one. Three energy cells. Interesting. Why is the dog half on the bed? This is a lot like what my garage looks like right now. A bike that um, is actively being repaired. And um, not much else. All right. Wait, wait. Yeah. All right. Hello. Hi there. I'm old lady Gibson, or so they tell me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things, too. You might have noticed the very large building just north of here. That's Helios 1. The NCR runs the place, so it's off limits to prospectors. Repair makes you able to repair a higher percent of the weapon and total repair in the game, which makes the weapon do more damage too. So I should probably get that higher than 25, but for now it will be good enough. What do you got for sale? She got rigged cards, too. She's a cheater. She's a phony. Laser rifle beam splitter. Interesting. Do I even have a laser rifle? Yeah, she's got she's got a bunch of nothing. Sure thing. Let me have a look. Yeah, 2700 caps. And doesn't even fully repair it. Repair that. Yeah, only 13. It's not great. 23. Let's get that. I 
And we'll repair that. I guess that's good. We're gonna have to. Take care now. We're gonna have to settle for repairing that way. For now, at least. Let's see what she got in here, though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure pre-war money is not worth anything. But if you find, like, other currencies, like NCR, or, like, the Legion coins or whatever, those, you can get a much better conversion rate by being able to switch them to coins. But you can't enter repair from a body you're looting. Uh, am I supposed to? I don't know how it works. Like I said, I, I just kind of figured I'd eventually click on something. A turpentine? Useless. Okay. Alrighty, well, whole bunch of nothing, it looks like. Let's go! Let's go, Bethesda Games! We climb it all. Hang on, hang on. Let's go! We are on the roof! Boink. Let's go! Let's go! That's a Bethesda game for you. The only thing that would have made this more Bethesda is if I fell through the roof. That would have been very Bethesda. But yeah, in terms of being able to enter the repair menu or whatever. Dunno. Also, is this where I'm supposed to be going? Kevtaku? Am I going in the right direction? I think you could check if you can repair weapons and armor without picking stuff up. Correct. Okay. So the place that old lady Gibson just told me not to go to, we are now going to. Excellent. Let's go. This is a restricted area. State your business. Lie. Your being here is a start, soldier. We aren't exactly overflowing with troopers here. But if you really want to help Let's us, go. talk to the idiot with sunglasses in the back of the plant building. He's been trying to get this place running for months and hasn't made any forward progress. Okay. Later. So let's just real quick. Talk to the idiot wearing sunglasses in the back of the Helios one plant building. That's legitimately what it says the quest is titled. Okay, or the description of the quest. Let's go. Ugh. All right. Let's see what we got. So far, nothing. That's a lot of words. Cool.
Laser pistol. Look at that. Laser weapon. Yoink. Boom, boom. Absolutely. Take it. Take it. Take it. Okay, am I even going the right way? Fuck, fine up. Your dog is struggling a little bit there, it looks like. Um, now I'm curious, what's this direction? Not a dog jump scare. Hey! Don't mind me. This is, um... Dorm inspection. You know, you, we gotta we gotta make sure you guys aren't like hiding anything in your rooms, right? You, you know, okay. Carry on. Empty, empty, empty. Okay, I am hidden. Interesting. Good thing I'm allowed to be in here, because I lied. Wouldn't want to be doing anything to make myself lose karma. Or, you know... Get on anyone's bad side. Another sawed-off shotgun. I'm kind of close to carry weight, though. Nothing in there. Okay. I feel like I'm kind of starting to explore the back rooms. Yeah, like this money here. This money, you you can uh, get a better conversion rate, I believe. If you um, exchange it for, for like gambling chips and then immediately switch it right back. And don't worry about it. No, I, I was just making a joke of the fact that I lied to get in there rather than having to pick a lock. You get a lot of it, yeah, and, you know. Like I said, we're just some, some silly geese. We're just, we're just doing the little, the little, you know, funny ha-has. Uh, I want to go up. What's up here? No. Some beer. Good, good. Never know when you might need that. I like how I look directly at the word empty and then still click into stuff all the time. Nobody could die in a very n n normal, not suspicious at all energy plant. Exactly. Oh. Well, didn't mean to kick that down there, uh, but it is now. I seem to have made it over to where the dog is. Cool, 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 cool. All right, so what else we got back here? Nothing. What about over here? A broom that you can't even pick up. This? Nope. I seem to be struggling at the location of an idiot in sunglasses. I'm going to assume it was that door I didn't go through earlier. Which is fine by me. Who did you end up helping? Uh, I ended up doing the Brotherhood of Steel for the main quest line. And I accidentally agreed to help the children of Adam on Far Harbor. 
I didn't realize what I was doing. I was just kind of wandering around places, then accidentally killed everyone in Far Harbor. Accident, accident. I literally had no clue what I was doing. I just saw a little quest marker and I'm like, we're going to go do that thing real fast. And then it's like, um, fun fact, you just killed an entire city. And I was like, oh, ha ha, ha 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 ha. Didn't realize that's what I was doing. And then I got like the blessing of Adam or whatever, like the curse of Adam. I got like a really cool hammer and I, I was like, you know what? Fuck it. We're going to run with this bitch. I also forget that when you sleep in this game, you regain your health. So I need to I need to learn to do that more often. Take milk bottle. I want the milk. Where's my milkies? I don't want the bottle. No, shut up. I'm looking for stuff I can steal before I deal with you. All right, well, guess I got to talk to him. Happy times. Yeah, the best of times. Who the hell are you? They bring you in to replace me? They're replacing me, aren't they? Ah, shit. shit Foreigners. I need We're here to steal I'm jobs. And I'm addicted to a lot of different kinds of chems. I mean a lot. Oh man, how am I supposed to buy chems now? Fine, here. What else? I'm in charge. This whole operation depends on me. Good. No fantastic. We got a no druggy running a power plant. The NCR suckling my teats, and it feels so good. I don't know, man. You're kind of acting like my bitch, like immediately thinking I'm here for your job, and then me bribe making you bribe me to not take your job well see we're getting power because the guy running this place is fantastic but the mirrors outside aren't aimed right so we're running at one percent efficiency and i guess that just isn't good enough for some assholes trouble is most of the controls for this place aren't here they're in the tower so go in and the that tower place has some crazy pre-war security system that the dumb shit NCR set off when they took over killed two guys now they won't go near it they want me to make an omelet but I can't break any of their eggs know what I'm saying yeah I'm kind of liking the how did you get this job option there's these two terminals outside they control the mirrors I tried fooling with them, but didn't get very far. You'd have to get them to talk to the mainframe up in the tower, then do the rest from up there. I'm guessing, but it sounds good, right? Hey, you're not thinking about going up there, are you? Well, hey, if you find yourself... Gotta fuck around to find out. Do yourself a favor and make sure you send the power to the right place. It needs to go to the Strip and McCarran. Because I get paid, that's why. Per kilowatt hour. Whatever the hell that is. That's where the NCR wants the power, so that's where I want it. But you know, if you do that, maybe I put in a good word for you with Fantastic's little helper. There's a reputation you can hang your hat on. That's not exactly a title I would be going for. Worried? Do I look worried to you? I've got this under control, baby. No one else can do what I do here. Mm-hmm. Fuck, man. Everything. I push buttons. I turn dials. I read numbers. Sometimes I make up little stories in my head about what the numbers mean. Like one time, I imagined they were a code to get into a vault full of naked women. Man, how cool would that be? Does he forget I am a woman in this game? No, man. I know exactly what I'm doing. Okay. I don't know what effect it's going to have. Over there controls power in this building. That station has readouts on the computer network. That big knob there makes a crazy noise. Uh, sparks come out of that slot if you put stuff in it. And I'm learning more every day. 
Yeah, this man has no fucking clue what is going on. It was easy, man. They were going door to door asking if anyone knew any scientists. I said, look no further. They asked me if I knew anything about power plants. I said as much as anyone I had ever met. They Some... asked me how well I understood theoretical physics. I said I had a theoretical degree in physics. They said, welcome aboard. That makes a lot of sense. The... Yeah, and I, I firmly believe every word he just said right there. There is not a doubt in my mind that he just Here, told the truth. You want this. It's the password to one of the terminals outside. Found it written on one of the stalls in the bathroom. All right, well, guess we got to head out. Which this looked like a door, so I'm going to try this one. So terminals tower. Fair enough. Look at all these mirrors. Which part is it? Look, I get how these like solar farms are supposed to work. I am failing to see where these mirrors are supposed to be aiming the sunlight to. Whatever. I'm not going to question it. What do I know? I don't know what's going on. I don't know if I'm supposed to be up here. So is this one of the terminals? Must be. Y'all just fucking sleeping outside? Fair enough. No, I can fucking see the tripwire. I'm not that much of an idiot. Ignore the two I set off. I got the one. Okay, well, can't do that shit. Log on admin. Enter password now. So that must be the one that... Connect Helios 1 to the mainframe. Purpose. Perfect. Okay, got that. So now I assume the other one's over here somewhere. The idiot glasses would die there. I'm impressed. To yeah. No, I, I, I 110% caught his, you know, theoretical degree in physics. Like, lied. That, that did not go over my head for one second. I immediately recognized the joke. I have, an, I have I have a quick idea on how to deal with this. Yeet. Yeet. Am I, am I missing? I 
don't get how I'm missing. We're just gonna just we're just gonna keep we're we're just gonna stick with this. I I promise you it's it's working. Uh oh. <laughs> How did I get that far backwards? Pink. Excellent, excellent, excellent. No, get me, get me stuck up here again. Pink. Surely his health is low, right? Maybe. This dog is fucking bomb proof. You you see this, right? The dog is fucking bomb proof. Someone explain how this dog is bomb proof. Watch, watch. The dog is bomb proof. The dog is bomb proof. I don't think that got anywhere close, but I, I had already clicked and held down. The bomb proof dog. The bomb proof. Y'all are seeing this, right? The dog is bomb proof. That is what we have learned today. Boy, come peek it. That was stupid. Bomb proof dogs. Unbelievable. Whatever, we're, put, we're putting this shit away. I'm gonna have to go find the password. Surely, surely I'll find the password in the tower, right? That's how it will work. All right. Nothing exciting. Okay, moving on, moving forward. Hello?
Eh, it's very close to me. Oh, I threw that way too early. And now I'm trying to fucking throw hands. This is all going horribly wrong. I I am aware. Come on, people, give them hell. We just gotta commit to it. Spot where the freaking turrets are on the ceiling. I don't know what's going on there. Come on! You gotta be kidding me. That's the turret. Maybe you should get your EDC, your EDE later. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe it's a thought. Something I could potentially be doing. Yeah. Don't worry, the ad will end. Okay. We're just slowly working our way through this though. We got our we got our handy dandy cowboy repeater. Nope. 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 I'm back. Welcome back. We're just slowly picking these off when I can hit my target. It's not going well, but it's going. Okay, we're down to one turret. There it is. Get over here. Now get away from here. I think I missed. That time I hit. One more, one more. I lied. There we go. I don't know how I'm still alive, to be honest. Um, that was like the worst executed fight I have ever seen. I want to stay up on this level for now, real fast. Just a just a better better search. Nothing, nothing, nothing. No, a bunch of nothing. Well, that one's obviously got nothing. Okay, okay. What is going? What?
We just took the we just took the quick quick single shot. Oh, oh, that's that's no good. That's that's no good. That's no good. That's that's no good. Kev, I'm going to be honest, that requires me to be able to throw the grenade or dynamite in the correct direction. Which I think we just proved does not happen. Let's do this again. Huh. This time, let's be a bit smarter with it. Take advantage of sneak. Yep, okay. Just trying to trigger the, just trying to trigger the Protectrons to come here. Should be another one. I don't know where the other one is. Okay, you know what? There's not another one. We don't need to worry about another one. What we do need to worry about is you. You mean to tell me like none of those shots landed? This is what I was talking about with the accuracy thing. That time I hit two in a row, not the last one. Oh. Very inconvenient angle to... My boy, I see you. You're getting warmed up? I'm getting warmed up. Let's go. Now this turret that I have a horrible angle on. I think this fallout have my favorite premise for the main quest. No babies or runaway fathers. Just you getting shot in the head and surviving going for right. I, and I got the revenge. And I did it. Okay. We did a much better job of staying alive. And if I remember correctly, there was nothing in here anyway, but... Well, never mind that whole thing about me doing a better job. Okay, well, since that direction seems to actually be the direction you're supposed to go, we're going to try going down first this time. Especially because I want to steal your crap. 
What else we got? Anything cool? Anything fun? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. It, it appears... It appears to be a lot of nothing. Oh, a safe. What's this? Nothing. Pulse grenade. Pulse grenade. Ah! It's funny how Bethesda games sometimes trick you to go to the right way. I guess, I mean, I guess, to be fair, this is a tower, so I would expect to go up, but instead I have to go down, which, like, cool, I can, I can live with that, like, that's fine. I just kind of pick a direction and I go that way as far as I can until it no longer lets me. And then I try to loop back and, you know, continue to explore. Sometimes I happen to go the right way and then I just forget to explore the rest of the area. Dumpster. Nothing. It is what it is. And fuck what it was. Ah. No, no. It, the sensitivity just got a bit whack there on me for no reason, I guess. Okay, I appear to be... Man, I just want to take a schnooze. Okay. I got the grenade already drawn. I just need line of sight. know if that did anything. Oh, no, it did. It definitely did, because now he's dead. Something straight ahead of me. I don't see what. Nothing up here. No, anything over here. No, no. A desk. With some cigarettes. I am very confused. It says death is all around me. But nothing is trying to murder me. Do I just assume it's through the door? Like that door? I, I'm going to have to assume it's through that door. I'm just going to I'm, I'm just going to assume that's that's where the, the trouble is. Okay. Yeah, this looks like, um... Just laugh in death's face. Okay, here's the thing. I already clicked to hold down to be ready on the grenade. Step into the open and identify your hostiles. 
law-abiding citizens have nothing to fear. Please step into the open and identify yourself. Law-abiding citizens have nothing to fear. Yeah, that's what I was hoping wouldn't happen. Nope. 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 Get out of here. That got a bit hairy. That that got a bit hairy, I'ma be real. I I wedged myself in that in the, the corner that's like right here. I did not think I was about to survive that because I literally had the grenade like right here. And I was here. Just kinda ah You know, hoping for the best. There we go. Um Okay. I guess that was the other door. I just don't have a high enough lock picking for it. Buffalo gourd seeds. Interesting. Okay, I'm safe. That is reassuring. Currently unresponsive. The amount of power reaching the terminal seems to be insufficient. Via an auxiliary generator. Well, not one in there. Okay, okay, I can figure this out. another way around this because I don't have enough repair why is there a brain Turns out, I'm just dumb. Wait, since when am I at the top of the tower? I was going down this whole time. What? I went down more than I went up. fixed all the solar panels. I don't have the password for this one. And I don't have a high enough hacking to be able to like get around the fa that fact. So I got this one. Didn't get this one because I don't have the password. And then I figured surely it's in the tower. So I came into the tower. And then I got all the way up here and it was like 
oh, if you just use an auxiliary generator, you'll be fine. And it's like, cool. So then I found the auxiliary generator and it's like, oh, you don't have high enough science or repair or whatever the fuck it was. So then I was like, cool, uh, I'll just have to figure out a different way. So then I came up here and there's a brain and then there was this guy with a variety of tools specialized for industrial maintenance, but I don't have science of 45, so fucking do nothing. So I guess now I have to just go find the other password somewhere. Because when I come over here to activate auxiliary generator, repair 35 or higher is needed. the other password surely it's around here somewhere what's this way This way. Nothing here, nothing here. What am I waiting? Why am I waiting? I'm just kind of backtracking, looking at everything again. Did you talk to the moron's helper? I did not. Do they have the other password? Because if so, um, that's on me. He does. All right. Well, at least now I don't have to search every like square inch of this facility hoping to find it. All right. Also, I can do a, a quick little schnooze. Now I got full health and a save. So we've officially locked in all of this. Uh, nope, stay high. Don't go down. Also, I can put this away. I don't need it out. I'm probably fine. Um, this is when a sprint would be really useful. But no, we just got to do it this way. We almost there. It's unusual to see a new face here. Are you a soldier or a scientist? Then we have that in common. Whom do you typically work with? Very well, yes. I'm part of the followers of the apocalypse. Sure. If you're not familiar, we seek peace and the spread of knowledge. Knowledge that must never be lost to the world. Okay. Now your turn. Um, That's yep. For sure. Yep, we keep peace. We definitely don't go start doing a bunch. But if it's really as you say, then take my advice. Sprint is missing in Fallout 3 New Vegas as well as Oblivion and Morrowind. It's so annoying that I don't have the freaking sprint. It's 
Ugh. Then I would say do it. As long as the power of this plant is committed to the regional grid and not... If you're the one to restore output... I did not mean to click, sorry. You choose, ...and they'll never be the wiser. I can't get you past the security in the tower. I already did that. I've discovered a password for one of the mirror control terminals outside. Excellent. You'll need it. Cool. Can I leave? Bye. Good. Let's rock and roll. Now, we just got to go over there, put the password in, go all the way back up the tower, turn it back on. getting there we're rocking with it we got a password let's go let's go okay got that bad boy now we just got to get all the way back up there Boing, 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 boing. Also, homeboy's fucking sleeping with his gun in his hand. And through the head frame, but we're not worried about that part of it. Don't, don't overthink that part. Okay. But yeah, see, look, you come in the door and then you go down. And then you level out. See, we're staying the same level, staying the same level. All the same level here. So we came down, now we're flat. Rather than going down more, we're gonna stay flat. And then we go down. Okay, so we went down twice now. And then we come in here. And we have to go down. And then down more, and then we come in here. Remember, we've been going down this whole time, right? Right? Like I'm, I'm not, I'm not an idiot here. I've been, I've been going down slopes, not up slopes, right? And then, and then now I go up one floor. Okay, so we've gone down like four times. Up one time. Uh. Thank you, James. Also, how are you? I didn't know you were here. Welcome in. Or I suppose you might have been here for a while. Makes perfect sense in a Bethesda. I guess. Do I have to go flip outside now? Is that what I need to do? And then doing good glad to hear. Alrighty. If you if you've missed so far, been sh lurking for a little while. Okay, I was gonna say if you missed anything so far, uh, it's been a lot of me complaining about the the physics of this game and the logic of this game. What does the quest say? I don't know. I just see the little objective arrow pointing that way right now.
Yet restore power via auxiliary generator. Use Helios 1 mainframe to send power to a destination of your choosing. I'm close to leveling up. So that got that that kind of counts towards something. I'm pretty sure the password is one two three four five since the theoretical physicist isn't too too bright. James, what are you talking about? He has a theoretical degree in physics. Is that not everything you could need? So now I gotta go figure out how to earn like 134 XP. And then I'm gonna have to clomp my way all the way back up here. Well, at least in theory. Yes, in theory. Like, I can't pick that lock. I literally just need something that will give me... ...enough XP. ...in order to level up. Hmm. Um, I missed. So, any, any ideas? Easy, easy ways to get XP without having to do this whole walk. I'm just gonna, gonna do a quick snooze. I didn't look in there. Okay, that didn't help. Ah. Uh... Hey, hang on, hang on, real fast. This this darn activity feed got itself out of whack again. There we go. Now I can actually see stuff that is currently happening, rather than stuff from two weeks ago. Uh. Okay, I got my bearings back. I know where we are. Because I can't do this one either. was that can I get XP from it that was stupid
Hang on, though. Hang on, though. There might be XP available. Wild. His health is not going down one fucking bit. That might have been a dumb idea. So we're going to hide in a corner real fast. <sighs> and put my gun away. And now we're going to go this way. Surely that health bar does not mean that I'm in trouble, right? Kind of forget one thing that makes this place even better. What? Are they fighting inside, too? I think they're fighting inside. What the fuck was bro shooting at? enough experience nope I got no experience from that okay I murdered someone and got nothing there's a kid in the freeway running around with a toy gun why? What good would that do? Oh, I'm over encumbered. Um. Um. Do I really need three knives? And two machetes? No. Same thing for two silence 22s. Get rid of them. Okay. Dog, I swear. Excellent. Now I can just take a bunch of a bunch of useful stuff off these guys. Hundred NCR. Let's go. This guy was rich. But not really a toy gun, huh? Now I'm confused. But also the whole, um, I need XP. Apparently fucking murdering people doesn't give me XP.
I guess it doesn't give me XP. I was even the person who actually did the kill shot on one of the... I'm kind of annoyed. around that I could get XP from. Because surely simply existing is not going to earn XP. Hmm. Game crashed. Nearly three hours in. Which, to be honest, that might be it for the day. I was gonna... I was gonna finish up that quest and then call it. But because I would need to level up and then go all the way back and the game just crashed, I'm thinking I'm thinking we're just going to call it here. The game has been a lot more stable lately. I feel like I, I played around with some of the graphic settings and stuff like that. It seems a lot more stable now. So. I'm not going to complain too much. Um, let's take a gander at who's currently live. Uh. All of these people I have either rated fairly recently or they're bigger streamers. I'm pretty sure. Let me let me do a real quick peek. Oh, wait, too far. I know we went to Medusa Kai last time. When was last doc running was 919. Anomaly was more recent. Winsome was more recent. And then, oh, yeah. Uh, literally, I'm looking at who's live. You guys want to go see Dark Souls? When was the last time I rated Marsh? 9-5. I'm, I'm thinking... I'm thinking we go see Dark Souls 3. Kev, James, everyone else? Are we thinking are we thinking Dark Souls 3 tonight? Not for myself. I'm going to get myself set up here real fast. I'm going to get this raid set up real fast. We're going to go to Marshmallowfent. If you have not gotten raided over there with me before, I highly recommend you check them out. Great streamer, lots of fun. Um, adopts elephants through stream. If you want to join me on any of my other social medias, those are all of the links. Feel free to check me out everywhere. I highly recommend it. Uh, I'm going to do Discord now because James still has not bothered to join the Discord. Despite the fact I am constantly telling him he needs to join the Discord, he still has not. I am going to give a real quick charity redeem as well or not redeem but um command because we do have a charity stream coming up it is next it is not this saturday but the week after so i highly recommend stopping by for that stream it's going to be a lot of fun even if you cannot donate financially if you can donate a lurk or donate some chat messages that is more than acceptable if you are following me and not subscribed you can go ahead and copy that message to paste into the into marsh's chat if you are subscribed, you can go ahead and grab that chat message right there, which includes my emotes. Assuming it loads. Thank you. Got that. Got this. 
There is what it looks like. All right. I'm going to be back Saturday, not for a charity stream, just for a regular stream. I'll see you guys then.